Good morning, guys. It is Thursday. <clears throat> Excuse me. Thursday morning. And Peyton's here. We've already fed the kids breakfast. They have their usual peanut butter waffle. And we had banana and some banana chocolate chip muffin. Um, I just wanted to do a couple of updates. First thing, I love that first thing in the morning, my hair always looks great. And by the end of it, <laughs> when I close my video, I have the, mo the messy mom bum from playing and <laughs> being in the wind and elements and such. Also, today, Jack and Peyton will not stop bickering. It doesn't matter what it is, they are bickering. <laughs> They're arguing. Yes, it is. No, it isn't. Yes, it is. No, it isn't. No, it isn't. Yes, it is. It is hilarious. And Emily is really, really whiny today. So, all of that being said, I love, love, love staying home. Uh, being a stay-at-home mom. I love it. It's, I mean, that's why my channel is called Crazy Beautiful Struggle, because it is. It's completely crazy. The bickering, the whining, the constant mess, the constant climbing all over me, and I love it. I am so excited, and I am so lucky to be able to stay home and spend all this time with my kids. And obviously, there are, t there are times when I get a little overstimulated, over you know, overtouched and uh, and everything by my kids, and I always, always, always try to remember this is the youngest that they are going to be for the rest of their life. They will never be this age again. And that's part of the reason why I get so many clips of Emily running up to me and hugging my legs. I remember Jack did that, not not nearly as much as Emily does, but it is the favorite part of my day is when my kids are hugging me and kissing me and telling me they love me and holding my hand. I just, it just makes my day, it makes every day. So in case you're wondering why there's so many clips <laughs> of Emily running up and hugging my legs, I, it's because I can't get enough of it. I just, I want to capture all of those memories and keep them forever. Um, we, that being said, a little bit of an update. Yesterday we went with the playground with the BI, the behavior interventionist, and the program manager. Of course, Jack was perfect. <laughs> As usual, when, when, they, um, when they are here with him, there were a few kids at the park, one of which I am pretty sure that he, w he had autism. He was there with his nanny, and obviously I'm not just going to start up a conversation. She's the nanny. It's not her child to talk about, but he did some inappropriate touching with myself and the behavior interventionist. Um, he, I mean, completely innocent, but inappropriate. He would hold our hands. He didn't respect, um, you know, personal space. Um, and it was funny. Jack was playing really, really well, but those two didn't play together. And the, the program manager said that that's kind of usually what happens is, is that if you have two children with, like autism um, or something along those lines, they will seldom play with each other and they will play more with the typical children. I'm not exactly sure why. We didn't go into detail because we were watching the kids. But Jack did really, really well. He has been using his words a lot more. There's a clip that I'm going to put in here from breakfast when he was, you know, he was saying, please, I don't like that. He's getting a lot better at, at using his words. Um, and yeah, I'm still, so that's kind of a Jack update. We are going to meet next Friday, so not tomorrow, but the following Friday, um, all of us to see if maybe it's time to move Jack from one-on-one -on -one intervention to, I think it's parent guidance or something, where basically the program manager will come out once a week to observe Jack and to kind of see how his progress is going with just myself and my husband. And if she feels that he needs it, then we can go back to one-on-one -on -one intervention. But she thinks that he's doing really, really well. So I'm going to, again, I'm going to try to jam-pack this month with play dates to see how he acts at those play dates. Um, the kids are chomping at the bit to go outside, so we're going to go outside. It's really nice right now. Um, and they're going to play in their tent. I'm going to try to get some footage of them in the tent. So... As always, if you guys have any questions or comments, please leave them down below, and I will talk to you guys later. Bye. Clash. Clash. Good job. Clash. Clash. Ah, fire, fire. Oh, God.
Are you guys playing firefighters? That way. Uh oh, don't get it in, in your peanut butter. Concrete. Take a bite, buddy. Concrete. Three, two, Waffle. one. Take a bite. Good job. I did. <laughs> Well, you guys are playing. You guys are more like bumping. We're hitting each other because like the minions in the minion video. Oh. Oh. Uh-oh. What do you say, buddy? What do you say? Shall we? He's been playing. He has been a little crazy. I'm not crazy. Yeah, you are. No, I'm not. No, I'm not. Sit. No. Sit down. Please, I don't like that. Oh, Jackson, I really like how you said, please, I don't like that. I don't like that, Peyton. Okay, we're not going to do that anymore. That's okay. High five, using your words, buddy. Good job. Go look for spiders. Are there any in there? One. I see it. Let me see. Let me see that. I I saw a green spider with spots. Wow. It's a spider. Some spiders. I found one. Ah, it went back there. Hey, we found one. Yeah, we found one. There it is, a little tiny one. Let okay, can I see somebody's flashlight? Oh, thank you. Let's see if we can see it down there. Can we see it down there? No, don't see it down there. Are you dancing, buddy? Our neighbors are rocking out. They're doing some yard work. Are you dancing too, Peyton? Look. The Mr. Hater baby spider. I'm a mama. Hey. Okay, go ahead and cross. We're both the same five. You're the same five. I'm getting much bigger. I'm getting bigger. I have long knees. I have super long knees. Haters of you. Right here in the background, you'll see that's the lake that Lake Elsinore is named after. We have such a pretty view. Such a pretty view. And again, I'm so lucky. I'm taking a walk with the kids. It's nice outside. Just saying. Love my life. <laughs> Myself and Jackson and Peyton are out and about. We're going to go look around Dollar Tree and uh, to Target because little mister back there is having kind of a rough day. Lots and lots of meltdowns, hitting, running away from us in various places. Um, lots of temper today. We think he's tired. Um, we fed him so he's not hungry. We're not exactly sure so we're going to get out of the house, change the scenery, see how he does. Oh, 
Okay, it is 6.25. Peyton went home about an hour ago, and we just got finished eating dinner. I made shake and bake. I don't ever remember having shake and bake when I was younger. I might have, um, but I always make the joke, shake and bake, or it's shake and bake, and I help. So I finally made it tonight. It was actually pretty good. It wasn't, it wasn't as good as I thought it was going to be from, you know, just... The, the dreams that I've had and the images that I've had in my mind of Shake and Bake all these years, but but it was pretty good. Um, and now Jackson is eating his Pez. Sometimes he gets Pez if he eats all his dinner and he has nice behavior. And the kids are getting ready for bath in about 20 minutes. So I hope you guys had a great day. Talk to you tomorrow. Bye.